Fifth Avenue, Central Park, and we're gonna go over the iconic Apple Fifth Avenue glass cube design. So there's three things I wanna look at. Number one, the skylights along the plaza. Number two, the glass assembly that formulates the forms the facade and the roof area. And number three is the very cool staircase design. So number one, you can see how much natural light we get over here along this plaza area where you get an incredible amount of tourists. So they incorporated, you can see these circles throughout the plaza, 80 skylights. You can see the skylight design that, that gives a lot of natural light down and into the store for everybody visiting. Number two, let's check out this glass. You have the beautiful floating door leaf design. And as we look at these massive glass units, you can see they create the facade area. And then if you look all the way up, you actually have an all glazing roof area. So you can imagine keeping this entire assembly weather tight so you don't get water down and inside was probably incredibly challenging. But as you make your way up vertically, what's actually structurally supporting these members is a laminated assembly with five panes of glass. I've never seen that before. So you have this laminated assembly going all the way up and then making its way across the cube to support the entire area. So lastly, to check out the stairs on the inside, we're gonna make our way down. And what they did is they have this laminated glass handrail, which connects to your railing and then is supporting the treads as we make our way down. So they really wanted to create this, I'll call it strange, it was very unique, um, optical illusion. These treads are actually curved to mimic or shape or, or mirror Apple products. So when we make our way downstairs as I'm bumping into uh, people is you're gonna see the glass simply supporting the railing and you actually only have one connection point between the tread and the glass itself. So what they wanted to do is create this sort of floating tread look as you make your way around and seamlessly curve your way all the way up. So from underneath, it almost creates an optical illusion, but an incredible design. And it was really important to maintain structural rigidity so that as people were walking their way up, you didn't get any uncomfortable vibration. So again, pretty cool that it was supported in one spot and then each tread only has one point of connection and that curved design is what gave you your rigidity all the way up as you dance up the spiral. So lastly, we're gonna check out people getting a new phone and it is cool to see how the addition of these skylights gives you some more of that natural light and creates a better ambiance for the occupants. So I'm sure an incredible amount of people have been to this store nearby uh, and have some thoughts on it. So let's hear what you got. A lot to look at, a lot to assess, but cool spot for everybody to visit next time you're in New York.